My name is Jennifer and welcome to the PDD Safety Standards Consultation. Okay, I am going to show you how to do the Safety Standards Questionnaire. So what you need to do is go over to this box and click on twice. Up here it says tell us about yourself. And here it says, which group do you most identify with? And in brackets it says, choose one. Number one, individuals receiving supports from the PDD program. PDD stands for Persons with Developmental Disabilities Program. Number two, family member, guardian of an individual receiving supports from the PDD program. Number three, service provider. A service provider is the agency that provides you support. Advocacy group, professional organization member. An advocacy group can be something like the Disability Action Hall. Five is provincial government employee, which is someone who works for the uh, government. Number six, health and safety professional. And that could be something like a fireman. Municipal official, which is number seven. Number eight, housing organization and or landlord. And finally here it says other, and in brackets it says please specify. So we are going to click on individual receiving supports from the PDD program. So you click on this one. Then you go down to the next one. What city or town do you live in? And I am going to type in Banff. Okay, after you type that in, then you go down here and click on Start. So welcome to the survey. Here it says Introduction. We want to hear your ideas on safety in your home. This will help us find ways to keep people safe where they live. There are eight questions that we want your ideas on. It should take you about 20 minutes. You do not have to answer every question. So down here where the house is, it says, what makes a home feel safe? So in this box, you can fill in what makes your home feel safe. And then scroll down. And this yellow triangle here, it says, who helps you feel safe in your home? So down here in this box, you can fill in who helps you feel safe in your home. And the picture with the boxes on it, it says, what do you need to learn in order to be safe in your home? So in this box, you can fill in what you need to learn in order to feel safe in your home. And down here, where there's two hands shaking, it says, how can your staff help with safety in your home? And in this box, you can fill in how your staff can make you feel safe in your home. This one here, what is your opinion or experience with how the current PDD safety standards regulation is being applied? If you do not have an opinion or an experience to share, skip the question. So in this box, you can fill in your opinion on how the current safety PDD standards are, or you can skip it. This one here with the question mark and the little man in white, it says, in your opinion, what should government do with safe PDD safety standards regulation? 
choose the following. So here it says get rid of it, change it, nothing, I don't know, don't have an opinion. So you can fill in either of these circles by clicking on one. The next question with the hand by the ear, it says, how did you hear about the engagement? So in this box here, you can fill in how you heard about the engagement. This one here with the man and speaking, it says, is there anything else you would like to tell us? And in here, if there is anything else you want to say, you can fill it in this box right here. And then you go here where it says finish and click it. In this box here, it says thank you for sharing your ideas. We will be posting a summary of the feedback received on PDD Safety Standard Consultation website in the coming weeks. Would you be interested in sharing more of your ideas in the phase of the engagement? If so, your name and email to capital HS dot capital PDD consult at gov dot ab dot ca. Thank you for taking part.